I would turn myself into a small, tiny person, seal myself into an envelope and send it to an unknown address. I would certainly not mention names of streets or cities. However, I would write down a few coordinates. Clear sky, tall green grass caressing the skies, birds singing, shady trees, one hill, two hills, warm, happy face. Out of the dark red mailbox, I would get into a sack made of strong clothes, in a panel with other letters. Some of them would smell like ink or ballpoint pen. Some of them would be merry, others on the verge of a breakdown. A few of them a bit wet. You know, those letters that cannot wait to be opened so that they flood you. The sack is full of noises, deep voices with moustache, young voices with caps, wheels quick on rails, hoo-hoo, in smoke, engine contact, here comes the mail. I would take a pair of sunglasses out of my right pocket of my jeans overalls. I would wear them to avoid going blind because of the sun that is hitting me up through the white paper envelope. And she would open the envelope in surprise.